Hello everyone, this is Darren with Madcap Toys. We're going to do an eBay update as to how our sales have uh, transpired over the last few weeks since we did our first uh, video about eBay and the glitch issue and how to fix it. Well, in a lot of ways we do seem to be um, having had fixed a lot of our problems. Now, I want you all to consider the fact that we are now at the latter end of eBay doing a lot of tinkering and fixing with their site. So keep all this in mind uh, because our fix that we got recommended to us by an eBay employee whose name was Drew uh, was applied to us. We edited and did what we should do as far as our sell similar solution to reboot our store with item specifics and numbers. But with that being said, I'm going to give you a current update to where we are compared to where we was. And I want to try to make this as fast as possible. If you yourself also have done this method, please give us information about what you did, where you was, how far you went down, how far you're going up, etc. and so forth, down in our comments below. All comments about that is welcome. Now, as of currently today, right now, as the time of this um, update, which let me give you the actual time, uh, it's about 4, 10 p.m. here in Springville, Indiana, or I'm sorry, Spencer, Indiana. We're out of Springville now. Uh, our active listings are currently at 2,523 listings. That's what we have on now. At the time where we started the sell similar redo, we had a total of 4,033 roughly, give or take, 10 to 20 listings here and there. Our multi listings, counting multiples in the same listings, you have us up to 2,868 items. At that point, we was roughly, uh, when we started this, at 4,398 items. Now, our total amount that we currently have on, so our numbers are not where they was. You can tell that by the numbers of listings, active and multiples, and also the valuation of the items we currently have on. We currently have on about $46,500 worth of items on eBay at this minute. Uh, we had on over 70,000 plus at the time that we began our um, sell similar method. Okay. At the time, before eBay's kick up and burp that they did to us, we had got up, as I stated in our video, eBay issues, etc., and how to fix it due to the glitch, uh, which you can view if you haven't viewed the history of us on eBay. Uh, view that chat, that uh, video and you'll get all the information at that time so you know why we're coming at you with this information. We had got up to year over year 465% over last year. So our sales at 2019 was up to 1.465% and climbing up until about the first week of September. And then our sales literally tanked and trashed at the last week of September all through October. Okay, but we had got up to 465% and please do not think we are bragging in any way because any one of you guys can do the same thing if you work hard and you put your stuff out there, you put your best fit, foot forward and do what you gotta do to make sales. Um, but uh, we had, uh, let's see, what, what, what did we get? And we had got also up to about 70% on average, anywhere from 50 something, high 50s, to low uh, mid 60s and at the highest point at the time 70 percent month over month right well from that point those of you that have followed around and asked how are your sales still doing darren or madcap toys our sales from the end of september all the way to the end and i want to say around the last week of september towards the end when we started doing on the third week the sell similar method that we we advocated we had fell down to about 56% month over month and 40 to 50% somewhere between there, highing out about 53%, going down to the lowest at 39% below year over year. Well, um, let's see, starting, uh, and again, that started roughly towards the first week of September, but took and culminated at the end of September all the way through October where we struggled and was working to revamp our store as was suggested to us. Currently today, 
all right our sales average on a bad day will be one to two sales in a day which is still not great and keep in mind that we are hitting into our time of the year those of you that are like me and sell toys or whatever it is gifts of any uh ilk or it could be considered a gift or something somebody wants for the holidays we are currently right now 106.4 percent up in our sales volume month over month and again i want to uh, emphasize to you guys if you read the comments in that video ebay glitch and how to fix them we were starting to climb on the third week out of the hole that we had fell into all right i, I don't have numbers with me on that because i didn't track them uh, but we are still down roughly 42.9 percent year over year and we have been getting days where we are selling eight to ten items in a day roughly i'll say that because a lot of times things will carry over so that number may not be exactly on mark but because we get people that will buy and then pay a day later or two later we count them actually when they pay but our sales numbers may show one thing online but say something totally different in our books again worst days are one to two which we don't have very many of those right now our average days is three to six and we've been having like today i think if i take my total numbers including three items that are not yet paid for we're about 10 to so so sales and we're expecting probably another five to ten items by tonight so uh they have picked up guys they are doing better uh i want you to keep in mind that i do believe the sell similar method works i do believe also that putting in the updates as far as the specifics is working and helping us out with our competition, for instance, i.e. Amazon, i.e. Macari, i.e. iOffer, whatever the case may be, uh, and other sellers who have not done this yet. Now, for all you guys that say, well, that cost me some money. I had three people and one other YouTuber sort of smack me in the face, so to speak, and saying, well, I don't think that'll work for me. No, it may not work for you because you've got X amount of items on it, and I'm not saying each video is item specific to you personally but if you decide to use this method if your sales have still tanked which i believe they should be picking up because of ebay's updates pretty much being done as of for now on a lot of areas that affected for instance me and a lot of sellers that do clothing etc uh, but it may not be your specific case so keep that in mind not every video deals with every problem on ebay and before you do anything I'm going to say this in the video if you've got the patience to watch the entirety of this seven eight ten minute video do not start listing something or relisting something on ebay until you start looking at how many items a month ebay allots you to list if you go past that item number they will charge you on that that's common sense that's ebay 101 as one of my viewers had said in that video but i never thought in my mind People didn't know that. If you bulk list something, you're going to get charged a bulk price. If you only got 200 items you can list a month, i.e. Ex ex example, and you go on and you delete all of them and you list 200 plus five more, you're going to get charged for the 200 extra and five more unless you're starting at the beginning of the month and all your items have ended. So keep an eye on your fees down at the bottom. Keep an eye on what you're doing, how you're listing it, et cetera. This does work. I've had at least four or five people confirm on my comment board that they did it. Their sales had stopped dead in the water like mine was doing at the time. Uh, regardless of what a lot of people that blow air in the in the eBay community on YouTube and says, hey, you know, I'm kicking butt making a million dollars a day. Guys, that wasn't my case. I'm telling you what mine is. This is no BS. My sales were good up until September, the, the 1st of September, and died somewhere between there and started picking up uh, in August, October as we started implementing this. And they're starting to go more. We have a system and a, and a theory and theorem that we use. But, you know, again, do not look at what I am doing as it may work for you unless you yourself are. Because everything that we do is specific and i'm sorry about me doing that i, I i've been getting some pop-ups here um is item specific to you and yours i cannot tell you why you're facing certain problems because i'm not uh clued into the issues that you are facing but at the same time this does work i've had testimonies on how it works 
And I just want you guys to know that I thank you for supporting me. I thank you and each and every one of my subscribers. Please spread the word, pass on these videos, uh, share it. If you're new to this channel, give us a thumbs up. We'd appreciate any and all comments. We look for your feedback, whether you agree or don't, that's fine. We've not blocked a whole lot of people on this channel. We have blocked a few that use uh, some foul language because we don't want it, uh, because we do want to be friendly to each and every person that's on this channel or listens to this channel or reads the comments. And uh, this is not for age 13 years old or younger. Uh, this is an adult channel. Everything we do is for adults, but we'd ask that you guys that support us would subscribe, spread the word, share it, comment below, give us that thumbs up, and don't forget to hit that bell. And please do contact the FTC and tell them your thoughts on the new COPA law that they are putting out that's sort of hindering the growth of this channel. I've just started pushing this channel over the last year, very little at the time, but starting it more and more. And now they're just putting another block in the way. Uh, of those of us that are vintage toy collectors and dealers. But guys, I appreciate you. I thank you. I look forward to your comments. And I would like to know in the comments below if you yourself have seen an uptick in your sales. If so, daily average. You don't have to give me numbers. I'm not asking for amounts like I'm giving you. I'm giving you guys this so you know that this is not BS. My everything is out there. So you guys. Let me know how you're doing. Did the sell similar method help you? Did it not help you? Uh, has it boosted sales month over month? Because my year to year is still down, but you guys have to realize, and you, if you tell me, I had a guy say, well, uh, Darren, my sales are still down. I'm assuming the way he said it was 36% year over year. Here's the thing, brother and sister, you need to realize. If you lose six weeks of sales, you're gonna have one gigantic climb back out of the hill and up the mountain and over the mountain to get those cells back. So we're working on it. You got to look at each step as a victory. First, get month over month up and then work and strive year over year. It may take us all a little bit to get year over year back up because of six weeks. Don't sound like a lot of time, but in sales, that can put you out of business if you're a retailer. All right. Hey, guys, thank you so much. You guys have a great, wonderful day. And if I don't see you all again with another video, I want to wish everyone a happy, safe, and wonderful Thanksgiving day. You guys have a great, wonderful day. Bye-bye.